let me say this before I get to my point. You are not what you have. Do you understand what I am trying to tell you? Just because you have many possessions doesn't mean you are this special type of person. Just because you have a very nice car and house doesn't mean you are better than everyone. Likewise, or should I say, just because you are poor and really don't have much doesn't mean you are a warm insignificant, a bug, dirt, loser, or whatever else. Don't identify with what you have if you understand what I am trying to tell you. So whether you have much or little, it really doesn't matter in the aspect of who you are. I believe the way you are determines the way you are. <laughs> so my personality, right, determines who I am. Kevin has a nice car. Kevin has many tools, which I don't. So that means Kevin is like a, a rock star or something. No. So don't go out there and buy a whole bunch of stuff and think to yourself, well, I am this special type of person now because, you know, I have much stuff. That makes no sense in my opinion. Me, I am attracted to people with a certain type of personality. Just because a person has a nice home, a nice car, and a lot of money doesn't mean I am, doesn't mean I want to be that person's friend. Doesn't mean I want to make that woman my wife doesn't mean I want to hang out with that person. I look, primarily, I guess I can say, at a person's personality. Because if you take away the money, you take away the car, you take away this, you take away that, what do you have? What do you have? Let's say you want to marry a man or a woman for money. Okay, you take away the money, what do you have? You want to marry a woman for how pretty she is. You take away the beauty, what do you have? Everyone, well, if we live until we are old, I believe much of us may not look the way that we are now. In some cases, I guess much of us won't look as well as we may look now. So if you are marrying because, you know, that woman's curves is real nice and her chest is all that and stuff like that, if you marry for stuff like that, what is going to happen once that stuff sag and whatever else? So, I was going to speak about something else, but maybe I should keep it at this here. So don't identify, I guess I can say, with what you have. If anything, work on your personality. If someone doesn't accept you because you are broke or poor or whatever, leave that person alone. You don't have to be friends with everyone. 
well, I want people to look high upon me. I don't want people to look down on me and stuff like that. I believe there are going to be some people who aren't going to like you no matter what. Work on yourself, work on your self esteem. Stop looking to be accepted by many people. Myself, yes, I don't want to be rejected, but whatever. <laughs> What can I do about it? Should I try to please everyone? Should I act like something that I am not to please another person? Should I dress in a certain way because I will be talked about if I don't dress like everyone else? Leave me with that stuff. Let me stop here. God bless you.